daydreams. You've got to start tapping into them. So people always say, hey, yo, stop daydreaming, man. What you thinking about? When I was growing up, I always remember looking outside the class window. I'm sitting there so bored in a math class. All I'm thinking about is whatever I'm daydreaming about. Whether it be a person I have a crush on, whether it be some idea I have, whether it be this, whether it be that. No matter what it was, you daydream, naturally. Your mind wanders. It happens to the best of us. It happens to all of us. But hey, I think it's important to focus on our daydreams. Focusing on where your mind naturally takes you is important. It's about where you genuinely want to put your attention. It's what you want to think about. It's these little things and synapses in your brain that are telling you, think about this thing. Maybe it is a distraction. Maybe you're just thinking about a video game you want to play. But a lot of the times when people are genuinely lost in a daydream, it's more emotional. It's something that they want to be doing instead of what they're doing currently. That their attention is going elsewhere because their brain, their heart, their mind, their spirit is elsewhere. And sometimes I tend to think, let me tap into this daydream. In a way, it allows for this flow state to happen. I remember daydreaming in class in university. I would start writing down notes on like the top of the page. And as I look back on the old pages of these notebooks, I tend to think, wow, I remember what I was thinking about. I don't remember a single thing was going on in class, but I remember this cool coffee tea shop idea that I had. And why? I don't know. I was just thinking about it because of what was happening. I listened to what was happening and then I just let the ideas kind of flow and wander. But again, that's knowledge. That's learning. That was me thinking about business ideas while I was in a business class. That's the point. You should kind of focus on the little daydreams, little pieces of information that kind of come to you as you're doing something. That's how you get into flow state. That's how you genuinely build synapses, learn, and become more knowledgeable. But people say that, oh, daydreams are just distractions. No, I think that we should focus on those distractions because it's only a distraction if you think it's a distraction. You decide whether or not it's a distraction. What you do with your daydream, that's up to you. And even if it comes down to the more distracting ones, you have a crush on someone, you can't stop thinking about someone, that's a good thing. You're feeling, you have a feeling for someone. That's amazing, that's sweet, that's awesome. Like, that's okay, but understand then what you're gonna do about it. Are you gonna actually go talk to them? If you have a crush you never spoke to them, are you gonna go out of your way to do it? Focus on those daydreams. If you're gonna sit there and dream about someone, dream about someone, there's a reason. Your subconscious is having you think about that. Your subconscious is making you think of that business idea. Your subconscious wants you to flow somewhere else. Think about it. And for me personally, I tend to want to focus on those daydreams because again, that's who I really am. It's where your brain wants you to flow and go. People say that it helps for creative inspiration. And not only that, it actually is mentally seen as something really good for you. It's a stress reliever to daydream. When you're daydreaming, it's actually a stress relief for the brain. You're so relaxed, you're calm, you're in that rejuvenative state. So hey, if you're daydreaming, maybe it's helping your brain health. Even when if it comes down to problem solving, when you're daydreaming, sometimes you're just problem solving your day. You're planning out your day ahead of you. you. Feel it in your head. Allow it to happen. Don't live life in just a strict lifestyle where this is going to happen, this is going to happen, this is going to happen. Allow for the daydream to come. Allow for that flow to come. And me personally, I love daydreaming. It's a good way to emotionally process things. Thinking about things that are actually on your mind. It's important to do that. It increases self-awareness and it boosts your productivity actually because you're allowing yourself to recharge. Like I said, it's a rejuvenative state. A good way to explain this again is with meditation or manifestation. Those just videos and where it's guiding you through the meditation. You're being mindful. You're allowing your brain to kind of go somewhere thinking about this. You will be successful. I envision being healthy and happy with my family. All these different things are important. You're supposed to kind of allow yourself to see it, visualize it, feel it, almost like you could taste it. But again, that happens with that sense of mindfulness, that sense of daydreaming. And again, all in all, it enhances your mood. It improves your cognitive functionality where you're kind of thinking all the time, you're allowing your brain to flow. Something I wanna end with is that even all of those different factors don't matter, it's joyful escapism. Sometimes where you wanna be and where you are currently physically is not where you wanna be. You go to your happy place, you start daydreaming. And hey, that's still a good thing. So after this video, take 10 seconds, take 10 minutes, whatever time it is. And hey, make sure you go out of your way to start daydreaming again. Thank you guys again for tuning in to another episode here. I really do appreciate it. And leave your comments down below of moments and times where you've daydreamed that you've actually really enjoyed just zoning off and being in your own world. Again, it's so important to focus and fixate on those daydreams because who knows, maybe that's where you get your best ideas. Thank you guys again for tuning in. Be sure to like, follow, share, subscribe. And I'll be sure to see you guys next week. See you later.